uko ready ku hata heaven jua ngumi mbwekse devo ananga talent so devo utegemea talent iko kwa mtu waone vile wata partner unaenda anga unaapproach wana record label unaambiwa sign a deal kwa sababu kitambo signature ilikuwa spirit ya mse history ni deep kuliko vile nyufikiria isi mziki tu is connected to heaven na download 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 na browse na browse Amen amen. Bwana asifiwe. Um let's begin with a word of prayer. Father in the name of Jesus we thank you for this privilege and we thank you for this time that we can discuss about matters that affect us on a very personal level. Let this be a solution and a direction and an answer to somebody. In Jesus name we pray. Amen, amen. Let's begin with the basic. What does secular music mean? What is secular? The name secular comes from the Greek word seclorum. And I want to tell you today we'll have a part one and then we'll have a part two later. So the name secular comes from the word seclorum. Na tutakuwa real. Kama mnashikanga binomio nomenklacha pia imtashika. So that name secular room in Amanisha without God. So anytime we talk anything secular to Amanisha without God. And if something does not have God in this life there is no gray area. It is either God or the devil. Are we together up to there? Are we together up to there? So that secular means without God and nature does not accommodate vacuum so if it doesn't have god then there is another power and another force that is active and that force of course is the force of the enemy i lost everything <laughs> that force is the force of the enemy i'll ask the person on the scripture there to give us today we'll do a bible laying down and then we will go back and now understand why this thing is easier. Genesis chapter number 4 from verse 21. Genesis 4 from verse 21. Jukuno wase ukuja wana kuambia pas history ya secular yiko kwa Bible. Wacha ni kuoneshe na Bible. I love to anze kuangalia possibly next time. Tuangalia the different genres. But sa tuangalia Bible kwanze na sema nini. So Genesis. Genesis 4 21. Genesis 4. 21 Genesis 4:21 Come on as a soma to soma 1 2 3 Aha uh -huh. So maybe we can begin earlier so that we understand what was happening Let's begin from Genesis um Genesis from from verse 16 Genesis from verse 16 so that we understand where this thing is coming. So let's read. So Cain went out from the Lord's presence and lived in the land of Nod, east of Eden. Aha, uh -huh. 17. Cain lay with his wife and she became pregnant and gave birth to Enoch. Cain was then building a city and he named it after his son Enoch. 18. To Enoch was born Irad and Irad was the father of Mehujael, Mehujael was the father of Medushael, Medushael was the father of Lamech. Lamech married two women, one named Ada and the other Zila. Ada gave birth to Jabal. He was the father of those who lived in tents and raised livestock. Uh -huh. His brother's name was Jubal. He was the father of all who play the harp and flute. Now, I want to show you where the people who pioneered music, the people who pioneered music, number one, were backslidden. This story comes after Cain has killed Abel, and the Lord announces a judgment of a Cain, and Cain is kicked out of Eden. Now, Eden means the presence of God. Are we together up to there? So Eden is not a physical place, but Eden meant the presence of God. 
And so when they were kicked out of the presence, they decided to begin a life without God. So after man was kicked out of Eden, after Cain was kicked out of Eden, he began a life without God. And one of the things that he began was music. Now, why is music so powerful? The, the influence of Lucifer in heaven was because of music. Is uh, it deep? Lakini tutachambua. Tuende kwa Ezekiel 28. Watatu wanze kuangalia. Ezekiel 28, 11 to 13. Kulikuwa na ranks. Mbili zilikuwa za angelic. The first rank walikuwa naitua the seraphims. Seraphims ni wale wanaitango makerubi wamezunguka throne ya mungu. And then cherubims wanakuanga wame guard glory ya mungu. So, Lucifer alikuwa cherubim. Alikuwa angel. Na alikuwa anajua holiness ya mungu. Tumefika hapo tusome. Ausiende kwa NIV. NIV ya itapati ile kitu mkona yo. Tafta KJV ama NKJV. Jiondo uko imeika in context. I hope it is there. Bona asifiwe. Bona asifiwe. Hii story ni deep kuliko vile nyufkiria. Hii si mziki tu. Hii kitu inakuanga deep. Moreover the word of the Lord came to me saying. Uh -huh, Son of man take up a lamentation. Kila mtu tusome. For the king. Okay, one, two, three. Son of man, take up a lamentation for the king of Tyre and say to him, Thus says the Lord God, You are a seal of perfection, full of wisdom and perfect in beauty. This is the description of the devil. Koivo devo simse muausi anamkia na pembe, he's a beautiful creature. According to the Bible. Aha, 20 kwa 13. You are uh -huh, the garden of God Every precious stone was your covering. The sardius, topaz, diamond, beryl, onyx, and jasper, sapphire, turquoise, and emerald with gold. The workmanship of your timbrels and pipes was prepared for you on the day you were created. What does that mean? That in the devil, kulikuwa na ma timbrels na ma pipe. Is it timbrels na pipe? Ma pipe ni ma flute na ma timbrels ni ma drums. So ukaona devo leo al, inaseme kananga alikuwa na inua one wing and a produce thousands of sounds because in him was music. Na aliona how powerful music was in Zion. And he understands up to now how powerful music was. Hallelujah. So, the only tool that can keep man out of the presence of God, number one, is sound. As long as there is another sound, other than the sound of God, you have man out of the presence. So, how does man produce a sound that is demonic? Kuna vitu kathanta explain alafu tuwane vile itakuwa. Watani avuase watatu. Dreamy come. Come, bro. Joe. I want to explain something. Now, the devil knows there is power in, in sound and in music. And he knows his influence in heaven was because of the music that he used to produce. Now, wacha tu assume uyu ni artist tunamjua. Uyu ni Mr. T. Hii ni soul ya Mr. T. Na hii ni spirit ya Mr. T. Wakati Mr. T hajaokoka, spirit yake inakuanga imekufa. So when you are not born again, you have a dead spirit. That is why vitu zote unafanyanga ni dalili ya kifo. Jumaiti haisikiangi uchungu. Maiti itabeba mzinga na ibebe mera. Na ifikiria inatesa. Lakini ilikufa kita? Hizo ni dalili za maiti. Maiti. <laughs> 
Bwana asifiwe. So in short, wakati hauna God umedai. You are dead without God. And so because you are dead, it is possible to sell your soul. So we see the body of Mr. T, but the soul is not the soul of Mr. T. Now let me explain this so that you understand. What is a soul? Soul ndo inakuanga na intellect, inakuanga na will, na inakuanga na emotions. Soul ikona nini? Ikona intellect, ikona will, na ikona emotions. So ni kukuambia wakati unasikia mtu amesell his soul to the devil by the way you sell soul i kwangi ati ikitu inatolewa because you can't see the soul most of the people who sell their souls wana kwanga wame ingia madio unayenanga unaprochi wana record label unambi wa signy deal kwa sababu kitambo signature ilikuwa spirit ya mse tuko pamoja so the moment you put a seal on something you have put your spirit on that thing so ku sell soul i kwangi at this dream so ali chinja mse wakachinja kitu wakatoa before ufike hapo inakujanga kama business deal na nikiangalia hata hii Kenya sidhani kuna mtu ame join illuminati msanii bado hajatosha unga Ju awakujiangi ma, ma, wase wamechapa. Thoni na jua kuna wenye nimeona nikawa na nyemelewa. Na kuna moja niliona amepiga matatu na nikajiambia labda kuna kitu anajua. So because devo haizi deal na wewe kama una gift. So usidhani utatunda form 4 alafu watu waende ujoin Illuminati ukue sauce. Mtu wa Mungu unaweza tokea hiyo siku na ni Friday. Usitoke wako na sacrifice, uende ka sacrifice. Bwana asifiwe. So ukisikia sijui nani alijoin, haikwangi tu msee alidunda chuo, alafu akatokea akaingia, hiyo hiyo ufala hapana. Lazima uko uko na kitu because devo hana kitu. So devo utafuta mtu ako na talent na gift and so when he finds a talented and gifted man, they can trade. You give me your talent, I use it for my kingdom. Ukisoma the book of Daniel wale watu walitumwa kwa kampi ya Daniel ya Israel walikuwa the handsome and people who had wisdom in all matters hawakuwa watu walipata madi na hawakuwa se wengi ndio maana walichaguliwa wakapelekwa kwa territory ya mfalme wakaanza kupatiwa delicacies za king are you getting me so now what happened at this hour is that when a man when the devil locates a man that is talented and that man does not know that they have a gift that came from the father this man can be used most of the people that have entered into satanic covenants they began in church akina beyonce akina nani and by the beyonce alikuwa na imba choir alikuwa anga choir member so nikiona wasome come church me stuka Juni kama church si reveal talent alafu ikinuka mnabebwa Some of our very own Kenyan musician akina Waire walikuwa anga CU Sauti Soul 70% walikuwa naimba church But Babylon ili walocate ikawachukua na Babylon inaanza kukufunza culture yake Hallelujah Bwana asifiwe sana So It is my cry and my prayer that none of you will be robbed out of church. Hallelujah. Unaona wasema dancer wa deadly wana dance. The next thing unaona kwa videos juu ya nani? Devo ananga talent so devo utegemea talent iko kwa mtu waone vile wata partner. So what happens? Wajan tumia tu jina ya Beyonce for this example kwa sababu story ya Beyonce is public. Anasema anga yeye ni Beyonce na yeye ni Sasha Fierce. So Sasha Fears inakuanga the name of the demon. So wakati anatembea tao anakuanga Beyonce. Akiingia stage kuna kuanga na transaction. Ile soli yake inaishia. Soli ya Sasha Fears inaingia. Sasa kuja Sasha Fears. (laughs) 
Sashafia zanaingia. Zile vitu watafanya kwa stage. Hata yana za ziangalia kiwa mtashi ndwe ni mimi ama ni nini. Si yeye kuna pepo. <laughs> Elikuwa inafanya hiyo job. Na kwa sababu pepo hayezi fanya job bila mwili. A demon is a spirit that needs a body to manifest. Now, sometimes anaeza ingia studio. Alitoka home akiwa Beyonce. Haka ingia studio. Vile aliekewa instrumento. Soli kaishia. Demon ikakujia Sasha Fias. By the time anaimba iyo song. Ni mtomo yake inaimba lakini source ni pepo. So by the time unapiga ma earphones kwa kichwa. Au skizi Beyonce unasikiza pepo. Uko hapo mtaani magizani. Uona sikiza tuka tenje. Kukaka. Mtu wa mungu. Ka spirit ka masturbation kananza kukuita hivi. Nani mziki uliko nasikiza. Na uli ya mupige ma earphones. Kuna pasi ya likuwa kwa ndai. God haka mfungu wa macho. Haka ona boy ya meka kwa mat na ma earphones. Haka ona demons ziki mzunguka. Haka sema whatever he was listening to was not music. It was demons. Na suwadangani. Devo ameachilia his final weapon. Because wakati music ime take over. Unakutanga kuna resistant ya gospel. Wase hapa waki dance. Wase wame changamka. Time ya worship. Wase wame piga one foot forward. Nikawa na pigwa picha ya jeshi. Buwana sifiwe. So is this making sense? Is this making sense? Juna jua, if I don't tell you why you need to avoid, I'll not help anybody. But when you begin to know why, when you begin to know why, utajua mbono utavoid. Ikitu ilikuwa kwa pepa, wakati Diamond alishindanga award, alishinda seven awards kwa Mount Kilimanjaro awards, kuna mchawi alitokea na akasema, kila award ina represent seven years of his rulership. Na akasema, it is in public. Na akasema, mimi ndo nilimpatia power. And behind every prominent artist, there is an AKA. So and so AKA. Iyo AKA ndo jina ya pepo. But amwezi jua. Amwezi jua. Ju the main thing. Ni kusababisha watu wa ishi out of Eden na system ya Cain. Wacha kukwe na mziki, ita wapatia hype wa skaifi kiria kurudia mungu. Na ukiuliza wa sewengi wa young bono wa jasevika, ni gengeton. Siki tubigi, ako ready kuhata heaven juangu mimbwekse. Bwana asifiwe. Bwana asifiwe. Na, na, na some of these people, some of these people, kwa sababu kingia kwa, kwa, kwa culture ya uislamu, ile kitu siwita uchawi inakuanga kwa Koran. Mambo ya kuchinja na kudedikati wanadamu. Unawana mtu wa miguu kwa damu. Kuna wakati msea na itango TID, Ali, alitoka jela kambio ende aoge lektanganyika na hizo ni marine spirits so si atuelewi hapa coast ndio kuna kuanga na uchawi mob ile kitu wasandi wa kenya wengi wa medu wanatumianga witchcraft hiyo ni known Kis, ukiuliza kina circuit akina bambu watakuambia unapewa kakitu ndio unapata influence mziki na chezwa kwa hii kingdom fame ni either ya mungu ama ya devil akunanga that's why wakati gospel tulianza ufala, tunaimba mziki na kaa hivi, lakini pia siya mungu sana, tulipoteza relevance. Juhu ni either unapigwa backing na devo, ama unapigwa backing na mungu. Bwana asifiwe. So, anytime unasikia sdui nani ya liuza soli yake, and what, why, what do they do? Wanapiking him same young. Haka mseo itanguwa whiz kid, iyo jina ni wizard kid, katoi. Kuna time nilijuanga kata shinda mama South Africa. 
na kakapewa award. So what these people do, wana o one media stations, wana o radio stations, wana o award systems. So wakona entertainment system kwa mkono. So wakati ume join team yao, utashinda awards hata kama you are the worst artist. And then they create a lifestyle that is not normal. Unaza kuona sasa Mr. T hapa amekafunga. Zile mande ya meka kwa video ako na made mamzinga. So kila tini ananza kudizaya hiyo life. Lakini hiyo life inakuange na kuselia vitu tatu. The pride, of, uh, the, the pride of life. Last of the eyes and last of the flesh. Hakuna kitu ingine. Ase uza. Ni unyama. Buwana asifiwe. Na lazima tutiulize. Ni kwa nini mziki na kwa ngemeta get matini. Na si mabazenga. Ni kwa sababu tini. Hakuna destiny enye ni vajo. For lack of a better word. Yani potential yako is so high kumaanisha devo akikushika saa hizi atakutumia for long unanipata so usikirie tu ni utini by the time wana in one na inafikanga age unafika watu kaa kina kuna generation ili ilikuwa eliminated ya kina Michael Jackson ya kina Whitney Houston wali madwa jua lingianga kwa illuminati na wakujua ni wame join So awali signing ba contract but wako na jua sign life. Kuna hata msani wa gospel wa TZ alisainiwa na Sony na alikuwa mbigi. Sasa hizi ndio wanajaribu kurudi ili lemekana. Amefanywa deliverance kaa zote. Contract tu hivi. The next song na alikuwa ameanzisha revival ya mziki TZ. Ha. Ni Rose Muhando. Ali sign deal na Sony Records. Akanyamazishwa. Saino anajaribu kurudi but sisi hatumtambui. Yeye yeah, alifikiria ni deal ya fame but ilikuwa destiny inashikwa. Na hiyo time ndo alikuwa anga top on the charts. So is fika point wanza kufikiria tu ni deal z. Devona kwanga amekushika. Juna kumbuka kuna same time nili signing deal na singe do songs for two years. Na mwenye alini sainisha hiyo deal aliniambia nyua sania msomange contract na even ndo mna signing deal za Illuminati. Jo umeambiwa pesa. Unaambia ukisaini deal tunakuwekea 1 million kwa account. Unauliza watu wana sign wapi? <laughs> Kesi baadaye. Mumeona vile katoi sasa hizi kanateseka. Kanaitwa nani haka kamesuiwa na bahati juzi. Yeah. Epita blessing. Kali sign deal akajui ni kali sign au kaliendea do. Sasa hizi lazima sheria itek course lakini ni ufala. Jumbono usainishe mtu ikao hiyo deal alafu anze kumtesa. Sijui kama unani get. But fear ya Mungu ikitoka kwa hati ya watu tunaanza kutumia watu kama vile tunataka. Hallelujah. Na fame ni God. Na fame inakujanga na demand na price. <laughs> so uni celeb. Ile life amepigwa mnafikiria ndio real. But kitu moja hu chali amepoteza hana freedom anakuanga at the masses of the powers that are external unaambiwa mande uko na interview tuesday ndio siku yako ya tizi thursday prepare fly friday piga tizi sato piga concert sunday pumzika mande interview unatumiwa na devo akimalizana na wewe anakudump I'm always connected to heaven Now download, download, download